What did you think of Gray tonight? Um, I, th I thought he just struggled to, to you know, he, he made a big pitch to get out of the second inning, um, but then, you know, had, had those hitters where he'd just fall behind with a couple pitcher, with, with a couple hitters, and it was just kind of work all night long to really get back in and kind of find that real good command. And, uh, you know, and then they were able to ding him enough there, and, um, you know, so, uh, you know, not his best, um, but competitive enough to, you know, give us a chance to, to hang around. Still manageable at trailing 3-1, then you decide to go to Loisica. What did you like about him in that situation in the fourth? Well, we didn't have a lot of length, we felt like, with Holder, so we were going to use Holder to try and get out of an inning and and then, um, you know, try and piece something together to where we felt like Loisica was in the plans tonight for that could give us two or three innings in the middle of the game as, as kind of a bridge to our back end. Um, but, you know, he, he got into a little bit of a funk there. You know, we don't make a play behind him. Um, you know, maybe a double play ball that gets awry, and then he, he lost his command a little bit. And and uh, and then obviously one big swing by by Maurer there when, when we got him out of there. Knowing the A's won today, any consideration at all going to some of your main guys earlier in, in this game and trying to piece it together that way instead of going to the Luizaga and Canelys? Oh, yeah. I, I mean, that was, you know, had we been you know in a in a tie down one up a couple you know we would have tried to piece it together because we felt like you know we could have got an inning out of holder inning out of green and then pieced it together that but we also felt like Loisaga, um we liked the matchup for him tonight tonight uh as far as giving us some, a couple of meaningful innings in the middle as a bridge are you concerned with the fact that that the a's are just two games behind you now in the wild card? We got to do better. I mean, uh, we go out and lay an egg like that tonight is just we did not play well all around. And, you know, this is, you know, the time where we got to start playing up to our capabilities and putting our best foot forward every single day. You know, we come off a game yesterday where, you know, we, we really bust out, get a really well-pitched game, and then come out here, you know, another chance have a guy on a ropes a little bit early and we gotta we gotta finish the deal and we gotta start um, really having that killer uh, when we get our opportunities you said that a couple times over the last couple of weeks Brett Gardner has said it this team just is not playing up to their capabilities why do you think that they aren't running on all cylinders that they don't necessarily have that that killer instinct when they well, I, I just think it, part of that is the the cyclical nature of of hitting and and we got a couple guys you know, trying to get it rolling again, trying to kind of get in that good groove. And then when we get those opportunities where we have a chance to have a big inning, we finally were able to break through last night. But we've had a, those opportunities where we've had uh, a chance at a big inning. We just can't get that hit to put us over the top. And that's where we got to we got to dig down right now and find it and, and try and lock in and 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 get this thing rolling the right way.